Hello my friends, today we'll talk about Bahia Principe. It's a huge resort located in the Dominican Republic, approximately 30 minutes driving from Punta Cana Airport. Bahia consists of seven parts. Turquesa, which is currently closed right now, Bavaro, Punta Cana, Bahia Aquamarine and Amber, which are adults only, and Fantasia and Esmeralda, which are family parts. Today, I'll describe Punta Cana and Bavaro, and my next videos will be about other receptions. So, Bahia Punta Cana and Bavaro are in the center of the resort, and they are the cheapest of all the Bahias. Each hotel has its own reception, but they are absolutely the same. This is, for example, the reception of Bahia Punta Cana, and here is Bahia Bavaro. The only difference is that Bahia Bavaro has this big fire in the center of the lobby, and in Punta Cana there are three huge palms. So Punta Cana and Bavaro are twin hotels. I'm really surprised when I see that Bavaro is cheaper than Punta Cana or vice versa because these two hotels are absolutely the same. They actually have one territory, the same rooms and the same services. The guests should make check-in and check-out in the reception they booked and should go to the buffet which is in their reception. But that's not because one buffet is better than the other. Other. The food there is absolutely the same. The thing is that the resort is so big and there's lots of people here so that they do not go to the same restaurant, they just divide people. One half does check-in in Baba reception and goes to Baba restaurant and the other goes to Punta Cana. That's it. So it doesn't really matter which reception you'll choose, Baba or Punta Cana. They are the same, just book the one which is cheaper. You'll have the same room and service services anyway. So, there is a bar on each reception, these drinks are included and these are not. There is coffee and tea during all day here. By the way, it doesn't matter which hotel you're staying at, you can use both bars of Bavaro and Punta Cana and of course they are identical. The territory of the resort is very nice and beautiful. There are many green areas, flowers, Reserva Ecologica in the middle of the hotel. Although there are no flamingos or peacocks, but still the territory is nice and green. By the way, it's supposed that the guests of Bahia Principe Bavaro and Punta Cana cannot walk to the territory of other receptions. There are no fences, but they do have security guys in different locations. When I tried to go to Sport Bar of Amber, the security guy stopped me and told me that I cannot do that. The same thing about Bahia Fantasia. But when I kindly asked him that I want to see the territory, he told me, okay. You know, the Dominican people are friendly, but apparently you cannot swim in the pools or use restaurants or bars. Although there was no security entering Esmeralda and Aquamarine. Actually, the pools and the receptions are the same in the, all the hotels, so it doesn't really make sense. But as long as other receptions are more expensive, the food and the drinks are a bit better there. I would say a bit because the food is very good here too. Two. So the territory is very big but simple. There is a train coming every 2-5 minutes from the reception to the beach. Three pools, two in the middle of the resort and one next to the beach. What I did not like is that it was impossible to find a chaise long next to the pool. The pools are big and there is space so they should definitely put more sun beds. I would repeat once again that the pools are really big and although the hotel is huge, there is space here for everyone. As you see, it's not overcrowded. Now let's go to the beach. Bahia does not have very long beach line like Iberostar or Rio. This is how it is on the map. That's why there will be many people on the beach. Although there are enough chaise longs here. Not like it was next to the pool when at 10 am it's impossible to find one already. So there are enough chaise longs, but 
few shadow the palms are very high here and do not create the shadow and those umbrellas there are very few of them and if you come to the beach at 9 a.m all the chaise longs in the shadow will be already occupied we were in july lots of seaweed that does happen in summer in punta cana Bahia is located in Arena Gorda Beach and the ocean is wavy here. They are not huge, especially in summer. In winter, the waves might be big some days. Although they cleaned the seaweed in the morning, it still arrives. Some days are good, some days are bad. By the way, this is the video of Bahia Principe Beach from April 2022. You can see that it's more or less clean and beautiful. Couple of words about the rooms. There is only one category, junior suite superior. They might have two queen size beds or one king and might be connected. The room was a bit old, but everything worked. As we were traveling to adults to kids, there were two small extra beds in the room. Now, a couple of words about the food. There are restaurants, buffets in the receptions and a snack bar next to the beach. The food in the buffets is very good considering the price. In the evenings they vary the cuisine of different countries, although the breakfast and the lunch are good too. Baya Principe is not expensive at all, although there was seafood, fresh juices in the morning, salmon for breakfast, lunch and dinner, different kinds of cheese and deserts. So comparing the food here with the hotels of the same price range, Baya Principe is definitely a winner. The food in the snack bar, which is next to the beach, is not varied. It's just chicken, snacks, pizza every day. It's open from 10 to 5, which is comfortable. If you want to spend all day in the pool or on the beach and don't want to go back to the reception. Also, there are seven restaurants a la carte, which you can book through a special terminal in the reception. I strongly advise you to do it the first day of your arrival. When we arrived, the first available table was in three days only. There is no room service here, but the breakfast opens at 5.30 and there are snacks at night in the restaurants. So, the food is definitely good and varied here. The animation is not bad either. There are two theaters. The first show starts at 9 approximately. It's not super professional but still good. And another theater is located behind the receptions. At approximately 11 p.m. they do different programs there too. There is a casino, a disco and a sport bar with games and karaoke. Also, the resort has a spa center, mini golf, a small trampoline. I really wanted to try this, but it was closed for renovation. There is a football field, tennis courts, and a gym. Not very big though. There is a small train inside the hotel which brings you to the water park for kids or you can walk 5 minutes walking from the receptions of Punta Cana and Bavaro and a small mini club for kids from 9 to 5 pm well let's make a resume the good features of this resort are the food is very good and varied for the price Lots of entertainment, I mean two theaters, casino, disco, karaoke, water park, etc. There is also water sports center on the beach, one hour free for non-motorized water sport. The weak features are the rooms, although they were not new, but everything worked and they were totally fine. Also, the territory is very big. It takes you 5-7 minutes to go from the reception to the beach or to your room. For me, it's not a minus. I like big hotels because there is room for walking after all these heavy meals. But some people do not like big hotels. Although the trains passed by every 2-3 minutes. There is no flamingos and big water park here. 
and the beach is not very long like in other resorts as for example Rio and the Bear Star and it might feel a little bit overcrowded in the high season but I still would really recommend this hotel because it has a very good price when I booked it the price was the same as impressive Vista Sol, Occidental Caribe, Occidental Punta Cana and I consider Bahia Principe is much better than all those hotels. So if you want a non-expensive hotel, Bahia Principe, Punta Cana and Bavaro are really good options. Well my friends, I hope this video was useful for you. Please support me by subscribing my channel and ask your questions in the comments. You can also book Saona for $60 and other excursions with us without any prepayment. The details are in the description. You pay for the tours in the bus. See you here in Punta Cana. Bye bye.